Hello everyone, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, please hit on the subscribe button. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to design a simple Olympic logo. And so we open our Photoshop. We already have our canvas set. And the next thing we want to do is to select our ellipse tool. And simply click, hold, shift, and alt to have a perfect ellipse. And we can just go to our stroke color, our stroke width first, and we can just adjust that to uh, maybe 26. And the next thing we want to do is to duplicate our ellipse. You can just uh, simply do that on a layer panel or you can just press Ctrl J on your keyboard. And so we have, we have duplicated our ellipse into five uh, different, five other ellipse. Uh, so the next thing we want to do is to arrange them. And make sure it's selected on your layer panel before you move it. Okay, so the next thing we want to do is to select all of them, hold shift and click on all of that from your layer panel and we can just uh, bring that to the center a little. Uh, do not worry yourself about the arrangement, we are going to fix that. So we can just click, hold shift and alt and scale that uniformly. drag it right a little bit okay so the next thing we want to do is to bring our ruler and drop it right here and bring another one to the bottom <coughs> and so we have to start arranging our ellipse To make sure it's selected from your layer panel. And so, as soon as we have that done, the next thing we want to do is to change our, our ellipse color. And so, we can just go to uh, shapes. And uh, for this design, we are not going to be using the fit color. So, we just uh, have that blanked out. and open our stroke color and go to our color picker and I already have uh, my colors uh, figured out so just come right here and paste and click OK and so we'll move to the next ellipse so I'll go to my layer my I'll go to my notepad and copy that back to Photoshop and go to stroke color picker and want to paste that click OK um, our color our shape tool and select our color picker and I'll go back to my notepad and copy that Paste. 
click OK. And so we'll repeat the same thing for the next ellipse. I think the next one should be green. Yeah, green. So copy. Paste. And click OK. So I think uh, I think this is the last color it's red. So we have that by default. If you own easy red, so you can just go to your stroke color and select red. And the next thing we want to do, if you take a close look at the Olympic logo, you discover that oh, I think I have to adjust this a little to your right. Okay, so I think uh, the first thing we want to do is to um, make sure this part of this uh, yellow ellipse is behind the blue. So what we simply want to do is to make sure this yellow ellipse is selected and we apply our layer mask and make sure your background and your fog color over here is white and black. And so I'll just uh, select my brush tool and uh, that's kind of big so I can I can reduce it from here size or I can just press the calibra key on my keyboard and reduce that and the next thing I want to do is to hold press control plus on my keyboard and zoom it and I can just wipe that off So, if, you are, if this is your first time of using the layer mask, the black, uh, once the black is on top, it's active and it's to hide out colors. And um, uh, once, once you have that done, and maybe there's a little mistake, you can just uh, flip it over here with this button. You can just flip it and once it's white, it's to reveal. So remember I said black is to hide and white is to reveal. And so the next thing we want to do is to uh, minimize that with control minus on your keyboard and look out for the next. Okay, I think the next one should be this part of it. Uh, the black is uh, supposed to, the yellow part of it is supposed to be on top of this black. So we we'll just uh, uh, select our black ellipse from our layer and apply our layer mask on it and make sure your your black to hide is on top so we can just uh, take that out and remember to zoom in so you can have a perfect work done and so when you make mistake like this uh, uh, is you don't have to panic over anything you can just go back to your layer your uh, tools you can just go back and flip it to white to review and you can just cover that uh, white space up to black needs to go out okay as soon as we have that done we want to minimize it control minus on your keyboard and okay as soon as we have that done the next thing we want to do is to uh, make sure this uh, green part of it is behind uh, the black ellipse so we can just uh, go to our layer and Make sure that is selected and apply a layer mask on it. It's just the same method. And you can zoom that in. Control plus on your keyboard. And do it one more time. And you can 
just flip it over and cover up this white space and you can just zoom that out and the next thing we want to do is to move over to our last ellipse and make sure this part of it is behind uh, the green ellipse so we'll apply a layer mask on it and uh, just repeat the same uh, method the same thing so we have to zoom that in and just adjust that to your right and make sure your um, foreground and your background color is black and white and make sure the black on top is active to hide and the white on top to reveal okay so just take that out Flip that over to white and cover that up. Okay, so we can just zoom out and select our background and go to view and click on fit on screen. And so we can just take our rulers out. And so guys, this is how you design uh, the Olympic logo. So please uh, uh, click on the so hit on the subscribe button and like this video and uh, leave your comment on the comment section. Let me know what you think about it. Thanks, thank you for watching.